name is Grace and today I am going to read the Bible story. Today the Bible title is Let my people go. The plugs and the Passover. Exodus chapter 7 verse 14 to 12 chapter 12 verse 32 Moses and Aaron oh sorry Moses and Aaron told Paro the God of the Israel says you must let his people go free. Otherwise, bad thing will happen to you. But Paro would not listen. So, yesterday in yesterday's story, Moses and Aaron has gone together, right? So he have came to Paro to let the people go and Paro will not listen So God turned the water in Egypt into blood. No one could drink it. When he filled the Egyptian houses with frogs, frogs were everywhere. Still, Paro would not listen. So first, God has turned the water into the blood into blood and next still power would not listen so God then the frogs fill the houses but when is where Israel are living there were nothing happened but still, power will not listen. There's so many frogs. So God filled the skies of Egypt with crocodiles, then covered the people like dust. Then he struck the land of Egypt with flies. Still, Paro would not listen. So God has gave So God has covered the people like the dust and there are many flies as if but still power is not lesson. Question, Paro let God's people go uh, after all the water in Egypt was turned into blood. No.
Pharaoh got killed the animals of Egypt, horse, donkeys, and camels, sheep, cows, and goats all died. Then he covered the Egyptian people with stars. Still, Pharaoh would not listen. So from seven bad things happened. The horse, donkey, sheep all died, and the people had disease. Oh my God. God sent hell to crush the crops of Egypt. Their brave flea and flax were destroyed. Then he sent locusts to eat the what fruit remained. Still, Paro would not listen. So, eight of not good things has happened. So like the hail has came and they didn't have many food now because there is case so many crops can be destroyed. And the flies came and ate the thing what is left. God set darkness over the land but it Again, Paro would not listen. God said, I will kill every firstborn son in Egypt and all the firstborn animal. So God sent over darkness that was eight. And nine and ten was very horrible thing. God said that he will kill all firstborn. Firstborn baby, also animal. Firstborn animal also. <gasps> Question what happened to the Egyptian? The first time Pharaoh would not let the Israel go. Number three, Pharaoh turned the water into blood. My people must kill a lamb, eat it, and put its blood under doorpost. I will see the blood and pass over their house. Those children will not die. So God said to Israel people that kill a lamb and eat it. This is Passover, okay? And put its blood on their door. Post, then God will see and pass that house, and their children will not die. Mm, I like that sound. Call this Passover and always remember it. The Israel obey God, but the Egyptian firstborn baby all died, even Paro's son. Finally, Paro listened. 
he let the Israel go. So even Paro's baby died. So finally, Paro let the Israel go. Bad things happened to Egypt because Paro would not let God's people go. True. Yes, today. Oh, we have get the star. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? And next time I will read another story. Then bye.